Thank you, Chairman. I can remember uh, once when our Republican colleagues were so sensitive to regular order in the Senate that they were accusing the Affordable Care Act of being a cooked up closed door deal, even when that wasn't even true. We had, in this committee, in this very committee, we had 47 bipartisan hearings, meetings, roundtables, sessions. We considered 300 amendments. There were 160 Republican amendments adopted. We sat in that big conference room day after day after day, going through huge stacks of amendments. It looks like what's going to happen here is that the majority leader is going to call up the wretched House bill on the floor. If there is an amendment process, it will be a sham because all amendments will be stripped out because he will offer a complete replacement, which will be the secret Senate bill, the first chance anybody will have to see it. No amendments will then be in order, and they'll cram it through on a fixed vote, with only then the secret CBO score being provided, and then they'll go off to conference with the House, which did the original wretched bill, so it will obviously get even worse in conference with the House. That may be the most disgraceful Senate process in the history of this body, and it is certainly a closed-door deal that bears no comparison to the open, robust process by which we got to the Affordable Care Act.